On Thursday, October 17th, a panel for East Kentucky Tourism was hosted during the 2024 SOAR Summit on UPike's campus. Tourism board members and associates were in attendance to network and learn about the current and future states of tourism in the region. Mountaintop News spoke with Community Relations, Tourism, and Main Street Executive Director Jill Dotson to learn more. So it was East Kentucky Tourism, um, and we all know that tourism and economic development go hand in hand. So we were able to uh, do like a fireside chat, just a panel about tourism in Eastern Kentucky, where it is now, where it's come from, and certainly where it's going in the next 10, 20 years. So we had friends um, from, from Bell County and from Clay County that are so involved there in those efforts. We want to be an authentic area that people choose to come to, that they want to come back to, that they get that real feeling when they come here of home and community. Up to $600 off select devices, and that makes this the season of saving and upgrading at Appalachian Wireless with a new or renewed line on any Appalachian Advantage unlimited plan. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. Audience feedback during the panel was a positive indicator that East Kentucky is thriving in the tourism department. City officials want people to recognize the city of Pikeville as a proper destination. Yeah, I think it's just tremendous and it's a wonderful feeling to know that you're not alone in, in your efforts here. Um, you know, it's easy for me to talk about things that are going on in Pikeville and, and our friends in Prestonsburg and what have you, but to know that there's a network of people who are like-minded and who see that Eastern Kentucky is a destination and we have so many things to offer um, is really a great feeling and knowing that, you know, we can pick up the phone and call one another and we can bounce ideas off one another and really come together and, and say, you know, if you come to Pikeville and stay, then you can go to all of these different areas and visit, you know, all of these things. It doesn't have to be a one-time stop. It doesn't have to be a few hours here and there, but it could really be a week-long excursion that you have in the mountains of eastern Kentucky. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.